The 27th annual Sir Troma Sunrise Warrior Liftathon was held yesterday and today at Brainerd High School. Clayton Castle spent the afternoon at the Liftathon to find out more about the event. There's nothing quite like the sounds of weights and conditioning. But these Brainerd High School students aren't training for Warrior Spring Sports. Troma Liftathon, Warrior Liftathon, started back in 1991. So this is the 27th annual this year. It's done for three reasons. Number one, to raise money for local charities through Sertoma and the fundraising effort that goes on in this Liftathon. The second reason for the Liftathon is to promote the Brainerd Weight and Conditioning Program, which has grown exponentially since it was started by Steve Nunnick in 1975. While a medical issue in 2003 sidelined Nunnick from coaching again, he is honored in the program through a scholarship in his name given every year to a Brainerd student. All that scholarship really means a lot to me, uh, as I'm sure it does to other people in here. Uh, it just proves how hard you've worked over the years. At the school, the Warrior Wall honors those who break lifting records in the event, but there's more to the event than the records or free t-shirts. The third reason for the event? to teach volunteerism to the students. All these kids are, you know, when you're that age, you often think about your own little world and the things that are going on, and, and you forget about the big picture and what, what's needed in the community. And we, we've had 130 kids rise up this year to help us raise funds, and we hope that uh, stirs volunteerism in all of them. Now, while the final numbers aren't in for this year yet, the event typically raises anywhere between fifteen dollars and $16,000 for charity. Reporting from Brainerd High School, Clayton Castle, Lakeland News. And Parsons says that in the 27 years of the Sertoma Sunrise Warrior Liftathon, the event has raised a collective $400,000 for Brainerd Charities. And Clayton did tell us, no, he did not even lift a finger uh, there. Why he, was, he had the suit on and everything? He couldn't. Right? I mean, I remember yeah. a couple years ago, I I ripped out actually, a few. You did. I, I, I ripped out a few that. spots on the bench press. Uh, so yeah. Well, what a great event though. It it absolutely, a lot, of money. Yep. a lot of money, and it's good for the the Warrior Athletics as well. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.